What's up guys, I just want to give you a short update on the the Arima boat. I realize it's been a long time and I'll tell you why later. But let's go take a look at the boat. Hey guys, finally got a chance to make some progress on the boat project today. I uh, started a bathroom remodel, so, and we got a baby that's doing two months, so uh, things are busy, uh, but I just want to show you all the parts. There's a lot of parts that would parts that have been prime sanded. These ones actually haven't all been primed, but important parts have been primed. And there's a lot of them. There's different shapes and sizes. Um, these are all the ones in good shape. I'm gonna take down to work and we have a spray booth. I'm gonna spray them all with the uh, setup they have there. It's um, They have a whole ventilation system and Man, the chemicals, the smell is not good for uh, us at the house um, because the paint actually, the fumes actually leak into the house. And like I said, the wife's pregnant, so no bueno. This is what I'll try to get some painting footage, but I don't have a tripod, so I'm just gonna set up the iPhone and uh, see what happens. It's only a tiny amount for Before, after, after, with this nice heat lamp going on, another one over there. There's a coat. We've got this pretty sweet paint booth at work. These are unpainted pieces. Really should have primed them again. See all the low spots. Anyway, turned out okay. This is just the first coat. Needs a light sand of 220, then another coat. More pieces need to get done. Anyway, so this is the paint I'm using. Right, so I'm only gonna mix half as much because I only have a little bit left. Gotta clean out the gun go tear apart the bathroom, come back, and hopefully I can do the second coat. So, I, uh, I painted all, I remade this panel and this panel, and painted these other um, wood, they're teak plywood, and it was, they were pretty dated looking, it was kind of like the fake oak veneer over teak plywood, and so I used Rust-Oleum Marine Paint, Oyster white, which matches the the kind of brownish gel coat really well, um, so they can see all the panels. That has a panel too; it's, it's just off right now. And it turned out awesome. I used the uh, Harbor Freight uh, automotive type sprayer at work and a spray booth because the oil paint is really stinky and not good for uh, little kids and pregnant ladies in my house. So yeah, I've done a lot of work. Also, I replaced the steering wheel with this uh, stainless steel one. It's a lot nicer on the hands. Yeah, put stereo in, speakers. I'm gonna do more speakers back here, but I don't, I don't know if I really want to cut into the wood. So, lower priority. 